Hey there guys, this is Muffin Sauce here and today I decided to do something a little different. I did a live stream alone where I drew what my dog has stolen so far during his 10 years lifetime. I'm not gonna say oh because I wish he's, he will live as long as possible of course. So just in case you missed the live stream, I have recorded it and you can watch it here on YouTube. And if you enjoy it, don't leave a like and subscribe. It's been a long time since I've drawn with Photoshop because I've been using Procreate a lot. Yeah, yeah. Shoes, my shoe, Terence's shoes. I I think I'll draw my own shoes. Slipper. So every time he steals something, he wants to trade it for treats. He has also stolen uh, this ear cleaner thing for cats. Recently, he liked to steal things. I, I got no idea why. Yesterday, he stole a box of Q-tips. So a box of Q-tips, and Q-tips are like a lot of like This is a box of Q-tip. Ear cleaner. Box of Q-tips. Hi Jerry, yes I'm up early. Cause I think some of my viewers are not local so uh, I'm just trying to see whether they were See whether they will look. I mean, they'll kind of watch. Uh. Hi, Alicia. Thanks. Okay. I'm not used to using Photoshop. I've ever since I had uh, my iPad and Procreate, right? I've been using like Procreate all the time for my work, commission, and everything. And very rarely use Photoshop. <laughs> ah, he's stolen a sanitary pad. Yeah. And he ate a sanitary pad. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't worry, it doesn't have blood, it's a panty liner. <laughs> Stupid dog. I told Barney that one day his greed will be the death of him. I won't be surprised, you know, like he choked or something, then I have to spend a lot of money in the hospital and shit. Green tea bottle, yeah, a lot of green tea bottle. Hello, Ruru, Cindy, Chung, Chong, Chung, oh, sorry. <laughs> Sanitary bed. So green tea bottle, Poka brand, uh, Coca Cola. Okay, I just write bottle because there's like so many brand. Okay, when he goes on walk, right, he has stolen chicken wings. Don't understand why my webcam is not working. Okay, sixteen percent. Hello, guys. I'm drawing. Stuff that my dog has stolen in his lifetime. If I can recall. And then I'll post this on Instagram. Chicken wings. Yes, he has stolen chicken wings. Chicken wings. Like when he goes on walk, and there's irresponsible people, they will throw chicken wings and like half eaten chicken wings. Okay, half eaten. Half eaten shoot. Oh. That's my eraser too. What's the shortcut? Okay, half eaten chicken wings if you be like that. <laughs> he has eaten half eaten chicken wings. And then there was once he took a chicken wing on the floor and I wanted to wrestle with him to pull the chicken wing out of his mouth and my my finger got stuck in between the in between his mouth. So I I have to uh trade him him the chicken for my finger because I'm afraid that he will break my finger. So ever since that day I never try and pry anything out from his mouth ever. Because food is so important to him. Chicken wing. This one looks like human bone uh, but it's you get the idea. 
Okay, he's, he's eating shit. Oh, is this how you draw sh shit? <laughs> well, you all know my dog so well, ah. So disgusting. Disgusting dog. Yeah. Bones. Shit. You had children, right? He's eaten. Shit, he's eaten. Poop, but not his own poop. So, there are people's dog who eat their own poop. But he doesn't eat his own poop. So, he has all the nutrition. So, I don't understand why he's eating other dog's poop. Like, what possible nutrition does it have? Countless items. So, the cat's toy, they, he likes to steal their yarn ball. I'm just going to call this cat toy. No, he doesn't eat bakwa. Then this is a lollipop. It's those round chupa 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 kind of lollipop. But it's half eaten. Actually, it's just a stick. Lah. But I'm just going to draw the lollipop. Oh, it's working fine. Ah. <laughs> just thought Truffles was here, so you don't get to see her now. Lollipop, is that how you spell it? Tissue paper. He is cat shit. Yeah, I already read that, right? Tissue paper. Should he take the box? He has taken the box before, I believe. Bring him down is like treasure hunting, you know, you have to like look. Is he going is there like existing poop there that people didn't clear or something like that? Uh tissue paper, I think it looks like that. Barney, Barney. Why you eat so many rubbish? Then you drew all over the tissue paper that you can't use it anymore. He's also eaten a box of raisin. So this story is actually very funny because <laughs> it's not funny uh, for me at that point of time because I panicked like hell because you know grapes are uh, Grapes are toxic to dogs. So when it was quite dark in the afternoon because my blinds were down and he managed to knock over oh no, I managed to knock over a box of sun made sun made raisins. And then the vet and then I had to bring him to the vet and then I called the vet because I panicked. He ate everything and I can't even find the box of raisins. He ate the whole bloody box. I bring it to the vet, they induced vomiting and then they told me he vomited out the box of raisins and even the box came out and then they can see that the sun made brand there. Then I was like, what the heck man, how, how you eat the whole box? It's just small box but still how you swallow the whole box. So can you imagine, it's like this. Then he, he puked out and then the, the packaging came out. And all the raisin beads, and it's open. It looks like that la. I thought he was going to die, okay? Spend so much money and it has to be watered overnight to be put on drip so that all the toxic seems all the toxin or whatever will come out. Then I hospitalize him, stupid dog. Still remember that time. There was one time when he was hospitalized. Yep. The other time was when, when he had kidney problem. At first I thought he... You know that... You know that something has happened to Barney when he doesn't eat. So that's the... That's the... Um, the good, good thing. Is it good? Yeah, I think that's the good thing about having a greedy dog. When he stops eating, you know something is wrong. He also ate... Because usually when he pukes, right? He will eat his own puke. Whether is it bowel or undigested food, he will always eat his own puke. And then it's a race against time, me and the dog. Who's going to who's going to clean up uh, eat the puke first? Oh yeah. yeah, but um many times he will eat most of it already. Uh. 
box of Q-tips, puke. His own puke, own puke ah, uh, not other people's puke ah. Uh, Cause I'm not puke is very obvious. <laughs> you can tell when he take puke outside. So he eat his own puke, and so there was this time he didn't eat his own puke, and you know something is wrong. And then we found out he got kidney problems, but we managed to get it under control, and now he's back to normal, eating rubbish again. I got no idea how he got kidney problems or so, and. Oh, he ate my guinea pig poop. Last time I used to have guinea pigs. So there are this... Oh, lag. There are these three little round thing. And then one of them, the fattest, is cock-eyed. So they look like that. Then I not... Then there's... Uh, then there's bub this is le le last time I used to have them and then this is uh bubbles and she had the most amazing long hair and she has like super super long hair le le doesn't have long hair she short hair and then she has this crest on her head then bubbles had like a lot of hair she's a Peruvian so she's like super hairy and then I have to keep cutting her hair and and I always give her a very bad haircut because I suck at cutting hair. So I bought these two guinea pigs. But I didn't know Bubbles is plus one because she was pregnant when she came and she gave birth to Jinji. And Jinji is uh he also has very long hair because it's bubbles and Jinji is a boy. So you know I wanted two girls. But one of them came pregnant because she was housed with a boy. So I end up having a, another baby but because it's a boy I can't put them together and then there's a high risk of sterilizing them or you no know, so I don't want to sterilize them because they're so small. So I had two cage. And then Barney likes to eat their poop. So every time you know they poop like mad. Barney eats their poop, Barney eats their hay. And Barney eat their their wheat grass or so so like I don't know my dog is vegetarian I guess but when I give him like cabbage he doesn't want to eat oh he doesn't want to eat carrot I haven't tried broccoli because I heard broccoli will give him gas and I uh dog farts are nasty man especially the silent ones hey <laughs> why am I erasing like that I should just do this <laughs> So he eats hay. No, he hasn't eat chocolate or oh, aluminum foil. I have a vet friend who told me that um who took a picture of uh, one of the dog client he had uh she had and the dog ate a whole spoon. So in the X-ray <laughs> you can see the whole intact spoon inside the stomach. <laughs> Yeah, I think they have to bring it out. Oh, and they tell me uh, condoms are very common stuff that dogs eat also. Thankfully, Bunny has got hold of that. I know that we them, that them grow up. Disown the dog, man. He's eaten hay. Yeah. Yo, Bunny loves durian. Durian can be eaten. So he hasn't stoned durian. Um, You know, Hungry Ghost Festival? The prayer offerings. <laughs> so he. The what? What do you call that? Um. This kuei thing ah, uh, this is very big with this very big kuei thing. Cause that time I wasn't paying attention. Then he took the whole thing and ran off. So people were telling me that um, the ghost will come after him because he ate their food. <laughs> then they are they are trying to scare me, but I'm like, no, oh, the dog is the one who took it. Like, the, the ghost is not going to bother me, man. Pray. This is called prayer offerings. Ugh. Oh, it's called Huat Kui, yeah. 
why call hot way eat ready or hot or not so far he eat and he he he, he bang sai no hot le the only hot he gave me is lao sai maybe he hot la and towels he like to take towels i don't know for what and like random fabric like our floor cloth have he stolen clothes socks before yes oh my goodness the list goes on you're right he has taken socks like so many times socks should look like this can you hear the footsteps that's barney oh he, he stole my panties because <laughs> sometimes you know you wash clothes then we drop the laundry and then he's like always near me and then he just take, pick it up and go so he's like panty teeth and it always mine because I stay with my mom right he doesn't take my mom's one he takes mine socks he likes to take my father's socks panties I draw the back like this right makes it look like as if he can puke into the bag oh no plastic bag okay last one rug did I draw rug? towel can be part of rug or not? so my floor rug looks like this <laughs> it's like those from ikea then it's like a lot of mouth mouth thing recently he only started this nonsense last time he don't do it one so the floor rock has been there for years and then he does he has not touched it and recently he decided that i we go and bathe floor bug we go and bathe then we come out and realize the rug is not there then how to dry our feet then he's like busy biting the rug and he go near him he's like <laughs> so thank you guys for watching and staying through this whole video and these are some of his favorite things but okay uh, thanks for watching and i'll see you again in the next live video which i thinking whether i should do it once a week or weekend so weekdays i'll be doing cv draws with jerry and dan a good citizen and rex regrets so this will be uh maybe a weekend thing maybe the next time i'll try on at night or so we see how it goes okay thank you for watching bye